We start with high school cross country. The Abilene High Lady Eagles are just two days from their appearance in the state meet, and they want to come home with a state title. Bradley joined the Lady Eagles on the road to get their thoughts. Abilene High is off to states. That's right, Eagles cross country is off and running to states for the second time in three seasons, and trust me when I say they're ready for the moment. I think it's a great opportunity to really show out, I mean, get our names out there for hopefully college, like running collegiately. Um, like doing well is really important just because we want to get our names out there, we want to get the Abilene High name out there too. This is one of those sports that is very, very uh, mindset and so for them to not only run for themselves but also run for each other and that's what I try to it's more than just running that I want to be able to teach these girls. It's the life lessons and for them to be where they are right now, I'm very, very proud of them. Some team members were part of states in 2022 and they've got a clear message for the younger runners. I should just have fun and you're not going to remember what place you get. You're not going to remember what time you get. You're just going to remember the memories that we made on the bus there, spending the night. I'm going to eat dinner and all those things, so just have fun and be in the moment and enjoy it. A close-knit team filled with great young minds, Abilene High is ready to roll on the biggest stage. Bradley Schimmel, Big Country Homepage Sports. Thanks a lot, Bradley. Abilene High's John Alcantar joins the Lady Eagles in Round Rock. The Class 5A meet is Friday morning. Girls start at 1045. The boys start at 1125. Now